really taking her time. Sign of maturity despite the young age. And 18, 13. That is a fantastic cross court from deep to make it 19-13 and Pia Zebediah having been certainly more challenged in this second game has now opened up and sure what is an unassailable lead of six points. 21-7 in the first. Listen to this crowd, it is unbelievable. Wow. I keep saying the hairs on the back of my neck keep standing up because of it. It is an extraordinary feeling here. They must feel the same. It's out. 14-19. Schnauzer has another chance. But she has to hear and feel that crowd, that intimidation. Extraordinary power of the people around her. Two more points for Indonesia required. It's short. <laughs> Come on, Jill. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> Look at the determination in her movement there. Not having to retrieve the shuttle because, of course, there was an error from the Indonesian. But that was a wonderful shot of seeing the German so determined. The crowd are actually a little quieter now because they can see this is a tremendous fight. Karen Schneiser will not give up. 16-19, three in a row. My goodness, we thought it would be all over by now. What a fabulous attempt by Zebediah, but it was the drop by Schnazza. And look at her bouncing. Oh, Pia now. Listen to Pia from the, from the German. He's got a megaphone there. Look at him. <laughs> 16-19. Still two required by Indonesia. It's good. It's in. It's 20 points to 16. We are on the verge of another little bit of history. It's 2016. One more point required for this match. One more point required for a place in the final against China. That is the wishes of the Indonesian people. And that will be delivered by Pia Zebediah in just a few moments. Four match points. That must be no. Now it is. Yes, it is. Well played, Pia Zabadaya. Well played, Karen Schnazer, for putting up a fabulous fight in the second game. But now the whole stadium, Estora Sanayan, erupts with gleeful pleasure and that hey is that a dad it could well be you know because he's taken a full part in her wonderful yeah look at this oh man celebrations are plenty indonesia the host of the 2008 ubed cup have made it into the final what an achievement what a fabulous moment for the whole of indonesia 200 million people celebrate around this fantastic country that spans the equator. What more can you say, but what a triumph. Jill, I've got tears in my eyes. Yes, it's, it's wonderful that Indonesia resurgence in women's badminton, of course. They had their glory days and 
the Indonesian team here weren't expected to get through to the final. They came up against the number two seeds, Japan, in the group stage, and they beat them, and they thoroughly deserved their victory here today in the semi-final against surprise semi-finalist Germany. And it's wonderful scenes here as we're watching a replay of that final rally, the glorious cross-court neck shot from Pierre. Great sportsmanship shown by the German team who immediately went across to the Indonesians to congratulate them individually and that's great to see and now the Indonesian players thank the crowd. It, it really is just marvellous. This is what sport is all about. We're up there to the right of the screen but not content with bowing to us, they now bow to the far end. And not for 10 years have we seen such joy in the Indonesian camp. Extraordinary scenes here in Jakarta as Indonesia go into the final. And I can tell you what, I, for one, am delighted to see it because it means on Saturday we have a spectacular occasion to behold once again. It is something that I will never forget, seeing Indonesia celebrate another wonderful win in the Uber Cup. And who knows, maybe tomorrow they will do the same in the Thomas Cup and make it a double. That's something that the, the future will behold and will identify. We will bring that to you during tomorrow evening's coverage. We hope you've enjoyed this one. We've got the presentation coming up in a couple of moments, I think, of the bronze medal for the Germans, and they put up a great battle. Don't forget, they won the first point in this matchup as well. But Susie Sazanti there, she will be over the moon with that performance by this young team of Indonesian girls. They have come through with style and now the emotion. Indonesia go into the final then on Saturday. Don't miss a big, big moment in their history as they challenge China for the Uber Cup 2008.